Hello, welcome to this video tutorial. Today we are going to create programmatically the UML model of this uh, class diagram programmatically using uh, an ECOR file. So to do that, let's go to our Eclipse and create a new project. The project can be of any type, either a Java project or a QVTO project. So for that, I would prefer to use a QVTO project. So here, we go on the model to model transformation, create a new project called UML model eco simple project next actually this option you are not going to use them but let's just create them finish okay where is our project let's go to you okay here is our project so under the project we create a new folder called model here is where we will save our model then now you right click the model folder new you have to create look for the eco file here yeah, under eclipse modeling framework we have eco model next let's call it my family eco finish okay here is the empty model so we go to our newly created eco file right click it then open with ocl ocl sorry in eco editor so here is where we are going to create our model so we start with the package Package name is family, it can be anything, and we have to create one instance of our model. Here is a package, one instance of package, and assign it a URL. Here is the URI where your model will be located, so you can just enter anything. HTTP local or slash maybe model driven development then family go actually it can be anything then now here is our package ready now let's go to our diagram so we have the class family so create class family it's having one attribute Called H, so attribute H of type integer. Okay, our family is ready. Then now, this class is inherited by the parent 
on the child class. So we create our parent and child class that extend the family class. Class parent extend family. Then another class child extend family. Okay, then now you have to create the association between the two classes. Here, a parent can have one or many son or a child can have one or two father so we start with the father class here we should create a property to implement the association so the property is having here you are having son Father and son is of type child, and a parent can have one or many child children. Sorry. Then now the second one. Property. I will have parents so here you have father son father is of type parents and son will have two or men Parents. Then our diagram is ready. So let us check this. Open this model and see how it look like. So we right click our model. Go to open with simple eco model and palm here is our model so here you have the family and on the family you have parents that extend the family and having one or many son and a child that extend family and having n too many two too many parents so now in order to use it in QVTO you have will need to instantiate it so if you right click if you right click the family class create instance Here our family is created if we click on it now we are not able to create parents of children of a family and the same thing if we continue you will create we go here but this is not what we want we want to be able to create everything from the instance so in order to do that we need to create one additional class that will call call a container class i don't know if you get the problem or not but we need to create a top the root class here we call it container or root here 
here is sorry my computer is very slow container and under the container you should create a property families so here we have a set of families then save it let's go again and open our class simple now if we instantiate the container what will happen still you are not able to create instance of the family so what is missing here add composition you have to set the composition so you need you want an ordered composition you write ordered compose now if you go back to our container right click it you are able to create child children so if you create a family now you create a family under a family you will be able to create parents nope okay and the container we can also create children and Here we can set properties. Suppose uh, this parent age is 50. Here, the son of the parents, we only have one child, so we add it. Automatically, you see it appear. The parent we have added the child under the parent but automatically the property also appear in uh, the child instance and now we enter the age 20 so that is it for this tutorial so actually now you can use this instance now with UVT to make some manipulations and so on so the aim of this tutorial was just to show you how you can create an eco file programmatically with uh, programmatically using Eclipse. So for now on, you are free to do whatever you want. And thank you for watching. And sorry for being a bit slow. See you next time. Bye.